These are all the individuals from um, from last year doing their thing, running 100 meters and all that cool stuff. Mm -hmm. And the American man here was incredibly fast. Yeah. It was quite close, wasn't it? Oh, message? Oh, from Michelle. How oh, very Good. amazing. So you realize to watch it together? Yes. Let's have a look. Hey, Prince Harry. Remember when you told us to bring it at the Invictus Games? Careful what you wish for. Boom. Oh, really? <laughs> Please. Boom. Uh, glory and honor to Father Ahaya to Yeshaya HaMashiach, our Savior, and our King, and to the Holy Spirit, Ruach HaKodesh. Shalom, everyone. Um, I am coming tonight because Father has placed some things in my feed this evening. Um, several confirmations that war and, and sudden destruction is upon us. And so I pray that we each are prepared for what is to come because we don't know when these things are going to transpire but he continues to let us know that we're in this season for war and he is giving warning after warning after warning for us to be vigilant so the reason why i played this video first is because earlier in the evening i was on my google feed searching for some things and before i could even type in what i was looking for this picture that you see on the screen this article was in my feed and I knew it was important because a couple of months back um, my sister in Christ Queen Deborah Michaela she shared with me privately um, a 40 second video it was like, like an ad that the Queen and Prince Harry did about the Invictus games and if you watch that clip carefully they show the cell phone which has the timestamp 1815 and so in the Strong's Concordance 1815 means to burn not only that but they mentioned the word boom several times boom boom and tonight after I saw this article and I shared it with her privately she replied to me and told me that she had just taken a nap and she was just waking up and she said all she could remember was hearing Russia is coming. In which I'm being prompted to share a dream that I was given January of 2017. I was shown myself in a classroom and I had a cell phone in my hand and I had received an email. And so when I opened up the email, I was told from the Most High Father, things that were coming in the future. And I was trying to tell the people in the classroom with me. And some of them listened, some of them didn't. Some of them looked at me very strangely and ignored me. And the instructor of this classroom basically kicked me out and told me that if anyone else in the classroom wanted to listen to me, that they should get out too. And there was one lady who followed me with her children. When we walked out of this classroom and off of the campus, we walked into an open field and it was broad daylight. And I saw the stars in the sky trembling, like shaking as, as if you would see something falling off of a shelf during an earthquake. They were falling from the sky. And I crouched down because by this time I had had several dreams where I saw the stars falling out of the sky and I knew what was about to happen. And then a bomb went off and I saw a mushroom cloud in the distance, but it was spreading and coming towards us. And next thing I know, there were Russian soldiers hurting American citizens across this open field in the very midst of a war between Russia and the United States. And as we were taken captive, the soldier who had my hand, it was as if time paused and a heavenly voice spoke through this soldier and gave me audible words. And the words were, Russia must come first, but peacefully and humbly. And then I saw a Russian sickle and hammer coming towards me 
but it was supernaturally diminished and it was turned into nothing. It didn't even touch me. And that was the end of the dream. But I am making this video to warn because the elites know very well what time it is. And they all are one and the same. Father's trying to prepare us. So I pray that we each prepare our households, your temple, your mind, body, spirit, your physical households for what is to come, brothers and sisters. And may Father's peace and blessings be upon all his children and know that he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High. We are under the shadow of his wings and he is our refuge and he will protect us and cover us in the day of calamity. So I pray um, that you all are blessed in Christ Josiah's name. Amen.